got fabulous hair. Look at that. Did that all on its own. I haven't touched it. It just goes upward. Needs a bit of fresh green too, I think. Anyway, let's see if I can set you up and if you can watch me work. Maybe that might work if I move down a little tiny bit. All right, let's see. I'll start with some paint. I may talk you through this or I may just work away and um, put some music over top. Although when I put music over top, it um, copyrights them. I don't know if that makes any difference, but if I could figure out how to put my own music over top, I'll do that. A little bit of black paint in here. So there you can see a little bit of the wood. I slaps a bit of black paint on. Disappears. bottom too. Just disguise the whole thing. There we go. That's one bit down over here on the work pad. Next, I'm going to paint the bed. I just have to decide what color. Oh, this is something else I was going to do. Is that a good sound? Now that I've got a garbage bag, I'll just shake my sandpaper into that rather than blowing it around my house. <laughs> On the shoulder, there's a piece of art that I did of myself in art school when I was like 19 or 20. What else is here? That's a Toby Rabinowitz, who's a great artist from... I'm not very good at this, am I? Ooh, this is a Toby. It's from here in St. John's. That's a spider I had made out of gold work in art school. Um, and my bike that I decorated for Christmas and haven't bothered to undecorate yet. All right, let's paint the bed. What color should I paint the bed? Maybe a red? The room is kind of, it's got blues and yellows and Reds, I think I'll go with a red, maybe an orange. Let's see, we can make a decent orange. Get some red, mix it with some yellow. That's not too bad, it's kind of mustardy. I prefer it with more red. I think this to this. This to this. I think this one. It's a touch coral. Let's paint that up. And 
just go through all of it. So it's one of the sweet things about this, I think, is taking out the furniture and looking at it. So I think looking if the bottom is unfinished just pulls away from the illusion. more staining it than painting it now. I just like some on my face. I don't want it on there too thick. whole side on it. And this side. There. Little. Oh. Yeah, I think that's all of it. All right. Bed is painted. Couch is painted. Put some glue on the clock. I really wanted the clock to work, but that's it. I have to work on my design. That's all. And hope this time it sticks. That's just a mess. All right. Mm, not quite. I think I have to bring it nearer. Knock everything inside over. Go. What time is it in the kitchen? It is um, 10 to 6 in the kitchen. That's a good time. Mm. I should just pull all of this furniture out. I think I'll set it up in front here so you can look at it. Um, my little tape. Oh, is that it a shot? I can't tell. I think it is. Little table. And chairs. Where's the other chair? There. And there's its little rug. So sweet. And then there's the little black couch. 
And um, in here, there are these little ones, which seem so rough now in comparison to the other things I've made, but it shows my progress. And if I decide to, I can make fancier ones. And then the two little stools from the boot room. All right. Oh, yes. I got a rug from the kitchen. Yeah, that should stick in now. Okay, next. That's done. That's done. Let's glue these things in. So... I think I will wait and put one of the beds on the side. I'll do the library first. So let's get a blue all over the back. And I'm just going to pop it in. Bookcases are my favorite. And then I want a little bit of art in there, like this little one here. Mm hmm now I need to make a lamp for it. What can you see in there? I know the light's not great. Yeah, I'll get you a close-up afterwards. And then, all right, next, I'm going to finish the bed and I have to make a chandelier. Those are the things I'm going to do. Um... How about I show you how I'm going to finish the bed? I should also move those things. Yes, yes. I won't be organized for very long. I never am. Can you hear the neighbors? Your driveway's right there. We've got the loveliest neighbors. Hmm? And there's one painted. And... There's a lot of oranges in this house, but it wasn't on purpose. Just works, I guess. I think the 70s orange kitchen is a charm. Okay, those are painted. The bed. So, what color can I put on the bed? Maybe blue? Knocking things over. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Give me a few minutes. I'm going to tidy myself, sort myself, and we'll make the bed. Yeah, not a lot of sun when it's pointed that way, but it 
it's super bright out today. I'm almost sitting in it, but it's moving so fast. I'll be on in a moment. So yeah, I um, got quite a bit done here with the, uh, there's the dining room and the kitchen. Yes, the clock is bigger than the stove. You can turn the hands on the clock. Oh, looks like it needs a bit more glue. Well, I'll have to do that. <clears throat> but I did put hands on the clock. It's maybe not my most successful make. Let's see. They're supposed to be able to turn. But maybe they won't. Because maybe I need the glue for that. All right, so anyways, the kitchen with the giant clock that's not there. I like the view out the window um, and the sitting room set up in there. And, uh, or the, not the sitting room, but the, the uh, foyer, the entrance hall. That might need a little more glue on it. Just put some of that decorative tape to give it a bit of dimension. And then, of course, there's the uh, the front room with the fireplace going. I think that's a sweet little one. Anyway, I did clean up the giant mess I made. I have a collection of all my little bits. My paint bowl. I did a box for supplies and a box for tools. And I've got a garbage bag. I'm right on the go. And uh, I've done some more things for these rooms. So for this room, I've decided it's a library. I made a little bookcase. I think the bookcases might be my favorite thing to make. Look how sweet that is. And I've made a little couch. It needs a drop of paint on the ends. There. But I've made a little couch to go up into with the library. So it needs a light, maybe like a... I thought I'd make a little flash red chandelier. Um, what else have I done? I've made little artworks. I've got some little artworks done up. So these are just stickers, basically, that I've um, that I've taped onto some paper and just glued some felt to make the frames. I have made some frames out of paper as well, but uh, I think I like the felt more. It's sort of, it's a bit more depth to it. There are these that need a, um, I think I'm going to paint them because they'll go on either side of this, which is the little bed I've made. So I've just got to make some bed clothes for it and a pillow and that will go in the little bedroom and I've made a little pendant light to go in the bedroom as well so that's what I've been at so um I'll set you up so you can watch me work a bit how about that so I finished the uh townhouse tonight um didn't finish showing you the progress but here's the boot room uh, the entranceway, and there is the living room with the fireplace, um, the kitchen, which might be my favorite. I did fix the clock. Um, I just look at that stove. I love it. Um, the dining room is uh, complete, and there is the library. Look at the bookcase and the bedroom. And I myself, I'm going to hop in the bunk. Thanks for watching.